how to make a parametric pivot doors in Revit. Let's start. Open the file door jam casing from part 1 to part 3 of how to make parametric doors in Revit or see the link in the description below. Okay. Select the door panel placeholder. Delete. Delete this reference line. <coughs> Select one of the door jumps. Delete. Select the remaining door jump. Edit sweep. Select the profile. Edit profile. Select this line, delete, trim, okay, finish, and finish the sweep, okay. Select this reference plane, delete, select this 35 millimeter dimension, go to label and select the door jump thickness. Select the 35 millimeter dimension, go to label, select the door jam thickness. Okay, go to interior elevation, change the graphic display to wireframe. Okay, select the 35 millimeter dimension, label, and select the door jam thickness. Okay, next. Go back to reference level. <coughs> okay. Go to family types. Let's delete this door jump single rabbit. Okay. We don't need this parameter. The door jump double rabbit. Delete. Yes. Okay. Next, go to create, set work plane, pick a plane, tab, select this reference plane, select interior elevation, okay, draw a reference line, draw a vertical reference line, align, Select the center reference plane, select the reference line, and lock. Okay, go to reference level, close window, make sure the reference line is on the center. Okay, next. Let's delete this reference plane. We don't need this. Okay. Delete. And this one. Okay. Next. Uh, let's open one of our door panel. Okay, go to front elevation. Let's change the graphic display to wireframe. Go to reference level. Set work plane. Pick a plane. Pick this reference plane. Okay, go to front elevation. Reference line. Draw a vertical reference line. Align. Select the center reference plane. Select the reference line. And lock. Okay. Next. Go to file. Save as family. Okay, rename, let's add Pyboat Modern Door 001. Okay. 
okay load into the project okay select place on work plane pick somewhere here okay pick then align over on the center tab press tab okay select the blue dot or the reference line okay hover on the center of the door space uh, tab pick the blue dot okay next select the door panel let's rotate okay rotate the door okay now select the door let's map the parameter for the width the height and the thickness go to width select the button and select the width okay apply for the door height select the height pick the button select the actual height okay for the door thickness pick the button let's select the thickness okay next okay for the offset from the hose let's select the seal height okay next let's uh, go to family types let's change the width to 2000 millimeter okay perfect let's create an angular dimension select the center reference plane select the center of the door okay select the dimension label select the opening angle okay I think we need to rotate the door uh, delete the the dimension okay select the door rotate okay next annotate angular dimension select the reference plane select the center of the door okay go to label select the opening angle okay let's go to 3d view okay let's test the parameter okay let's move the door family types let's change the opening angle to 90 okay 50 degrees okay and zero degrees okay done thank you